another thing when it comes to people of color is scalpel. Co-washing, I feel like, is definitely a major part of scalp health, definitely. okay? Definitely. And also moisture retention. Yes. Um, I'm a licensed cosmetologist. This is one of my clients, but also my best friend. So when he would come in and, you know, I was doing his hair and I would just see it in this curly state, like the curls were just beautiful, hydrated, and, you know, mine was just looking a little weak, a little dull. So, you know, I'm not afraid to get information from other people just to you know see what what maybe he's doing that i could benefit from so i asked and he told me about co-washing um you just need a really good moisture shampoo conditioner for me it's my scalp like i don't really too much like strictly cleanse like my hair i more so wash my scalp and it's like i don't strip it all the time i'm just like cleansing it and if need be i'm going to use a more strenuous clarifying shampoo if that makes sense we don't wash our hair that often um but contrary to the belief um it's actually very good for your scalp to get to be clean to be cleansed um you know when you're cleaning your hair um definitely recommend a clarifying shampoo before you start off with your shampoo because that's really going to remove all the dirt and oil out of your hair follicles make sure you you know get a nice um scalp massage in there also to activate um you know the blood flow um which also helps with hair growth um but when your scalp is healthy your hair really will grow healthy really that will. is true really <laughs> that's will. a fact so when it comes to protective styles, I mean, I have my braids right now, box braids or whatever, but you know, some people, even when you have protective styles, like please clean your scalp. Like they have products, they have rinses and whatnot that you can use. There are very non um, strenuous ways to clean your scalp while you're having your hair in protective styles, because if you don't, you're gonna have all that buildup. Um, and it's not gonna be good for your scalp. Your hair's gonna break off and- It's not gonna grow how you want it to no. in those braids. <laughs> Just people who have protective styles or whatnot, they don't take care of their scalp. I mean, if you think about it, when you're growing something, if you're trying to grow some fruit, vegetables, whatever, if the soil isn't right, then the produce probably won't be right either. I will say when it comes to actually washing your hair, here's where like the, I think the, some, some of the miscommunication comes in, especially with people of color. Um, me personally, I don't actually clarify, wash my hair or scalp often. It can be weeks or even months in between to where I actually will use a clarifying shampoo. Having said that, I co-wash very often. Water is a part of co-washing because water is moisture. And the water is gonna <laughs> cleanse your skin. But you know what, when, when you say it like that, the wa water is just a powerful thing in itself, okay, that God created. And water will literally wash away a building. So, you know, just by you, what I'm pretty sure it's washing away that dirt and that debris and whatever yeah. else is in your hair. But yeah. the conditioner is just adding that moisture back yes. in. So. A good trick, like, okay, to when it comes to moisturizing, like when it comes to even maintaining curls or even your hair, shafts um so your cuticles are closed smooth whatever sleekness of your hair um moisturize like if you ain't daily yeah like if you ain't putting the moisture back in your hair it's you know what I'm saying? it's gonna be gone it's gonna be gone it's, your hair's gonna be dry it's gonna be brittle <laughs> even if you just take a spray bottle with some water and just spritz your hair every day right. and put a really nice cream and oil combined Something. I mean, everybody has different hair textures and whatnot, so you have to find what works for your hair. But it's right. like, there are some things that you can do. Some people just don't want to put in the work for their hair. But, yeah. <laughs>